all right people this is Dennis and um, I just finished building um, student balance database for the school administration and here is just a preview I'm gonna show you how it works and you can follow through and build one two so this how it works um, as you can see I have student ID right here I can choose it has to update itself but it hasn't done that but let's see this student ID number two um, this is the trick that I do it's actually Eric Doe, which is over here. We go to the student info and student ID number one is Dennis Dennis, and student ID number two is Eric Doe, which is I have it on my report on my preview right here. Print out. And close this and over here I just choose the tuition of fees code and after I do my trick it should bring the description of the code which is a tuition and this is the amount which I have here in this table I have my tuition ID and I have my account name and I have the amount for each account name so if I go back to my form close this up choose code number three after the trick we have administration fee and it's fifty dollars per term which is over here administration fee fifty dollars and so this how the tuition student balance database work for me and after this is gonna sum up all the amount and give you the total bill due so let's finish with this one and save let's see and we can see we can bill the student for 2100 and this is the tuition and fees code and this is the description and this is the amount and over here we forgot to fill in the info and this is print period you save and you mail it out so it's just simple I have just three tables the first one student info which is this ID first name last name address cities which is pretty simple you can add some more if you want and the second I build tuition and fee classification and as you can see I have the course fee for three hundred dollars the tuition for two thousand administration fee fifty dollars no printing fee thirty dollars 
I can add some more and call this environmental. Yes, and save this. Close all, and it's the code number five. I come here, change it, do my trick, and I have it here, environmental fees, and I haven't put in the amount, so sure it's zero, and maybe twenty dollars, save. Close. I have to close this. Reopen it and it will be updated. You have it right here. And finally, I have my student balance table which is a little bit longer because that's all it's a little bit longer this one I have some I have it shot test for all of this but it's Over here is where I have the calculation. For instance, this one is a D lookup function, which is over here. And if you don't know D lookup, YouTube it and know how to use it. So this the lookup function for change the I student ID to number one. It's not gonna update right away, so I have to do the trick. I get Dennis Dennis. That's what the D lookup does. It look for. Uh, something from different table for you so this is it guys thank you don't forget to subscribe and anything you want me to make video on just leave it in the comment thank you good day